Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we will talk about payment method and how to set up the payment method in Business Sense. So, uh, if you have any doubt, please uh, uh, add your comment and subscribe my channel. Let's go to Business Center and check how we can uh, set up the payment method. So here in Business Center, we can go uh, and check the payment method. So let's click here in Explore More uh, and then click in Payment Method. So here basically uh, we have uh, the code uh, in the description. You, you just need uh, to add uh, this option. Um, and also, uh, we have here the option to say, uh, for example, so let's, let's adjust one uh, payment term, uh, payment method. So in this case here, uh, when I say that I am use cash, uh, I can say, for example, that I will use a bank account that I uh, have as cash. So in this case, this is one uh, of the options uh, that when we uh, post uh, one uh, purchase invoice, for example, uh, with this uh, payment method, the system will, will post the invoice uh, and then um, uh, execute the payment uh, against this uh, bank account in, in business sense. And remember here that uh, uh, in this case, uh, uh, we create like a bank account just to manage uh, better uh, uh, the value that we uh, pay uh, via cash or uh, the values that we receive uh, via cash. It's not uh, so usual anymore to, use, uh, to receive and pay via cash, uh, but this is one of uh, the options when you have um, uh, a unit in a, in a, in a small city that you that you want uh, uh, receive and pay uh, uh, with cash. Uh, what more you can do here? Uh, so basically, here if you want to create a, a new payment method, you just have to go here and add a code in a description. Uh, uh, this balance account type, uh, uh, we I already explained. So, if you want to post this directly uh, uh, with a bank account or a GL account, you just have to select here uh, the type and then uh, select accordingly uh, a GL account or a bank account. Also, uh, what Business Center offer is uh, you can use. Um, a payment method uh, for um, direct debt. So you just have to click here and also uh, in this case you need to select what is the uh, direct payment code uh, for this option uh, and also here uh, we have to define uh, what is the uh, data exchange that you use that you, you use in order to export this payment to uh, the bank and also what is the uh, bank payment type that you, you select accordingly uh, with the bank that you are using. So basically this is uh, the setup for the payment method. Uh, we can go uh, now um, and check one purchase invoice and how we can uh, select this uh, payment method. So let's go here um, and let's go um, purchase order and see here how we can select this. Okay, uh, here we have the payment term code. Uh, let me 
show more and uh, here we also have the payment method code so the user just need to go here and say uh, what is the payment method that i will use in this case let's see it will be a bank transfer uh, 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 and then uh, post the invoice accordingly okay please uh, let me know if you have any questions um, uh, add your comments uh, and uh, subscribe my channel thank you